see how y'all can hate from the other side of the screen. Y'all don't even suck toes. Joshua, can you close the room door? Okay. Thank you. Hi guys. So today's video is gonna be a short little video. It's not gonna be long. Period. So today guys, today's video will be about something, it won't be long, it won't be a long video, it'll just be me getting straight to the point. A lot of people have been asking me, like I was going to do a QA, and a but I think I'm just going to do this topic spot on. A lot of people have been asking me, how did I put on weight y'all? And I understand why a lot of people have been asking me that because I went from stick to thick period okay like i was really really small like when i lived back in the bahamas everybody knew i was really really small and it's like like either a year a year and a half after i moved down here that's when i started putting on weight but recently that's when i started putting on like a good weight as i could say as in like good as in like weight in the right places see that so yeah a lot of people have been asking me what did i do to put on weight well this is simple y'all this is the excuse me <laughs> okay well guys this is simple this is step to number one actually to anything on your body if you want it to work properly stop paying attention stop paying attention stop giving your weight too much attention as in like how i what i mean by that okay when i was skinny i was very insecure like i was like 90 pounds the most i think i ever weighed while i was skinny was 100 pounds and i was really skinny and i was really insecure but not until like a year after i moved over here i just stopped worrying about my weight i just was like you know what i don't care i'm still fine i don't care about my weight you know skinny go skinny girls rule and i would see like those little um facebook posts where they be like skinny girls blah, 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 little booties matter and stuff like that like you know that's how you know social media can affect the way you think which is bad but yeah um i stopped worrying about i stopped worrying about um Yeah, I stopped worrying about my weight. And the minute I stopped worrying about my weight, I saw a drastic, drastic change. And that's the same thing about your hair. When you want your hair to grow... Why do people know shut up? You want to hear that? Anyway, when you want your hair to grow, like, really, really fast, you would be surprised when you stop worrying about your hair. And you just... You, I'm not saying don't take care of your hair now. But just, like, stop worrying about it so much. Stop, like, paying attention to every little detail so much. And your hair will grow more like your hair the results of your hair growing will be more like like that then it will be when you just paying attention to your hair oh my gosh when is my hair gonna grow you just like measuring every little inch every little every week when you could just like figure out what your hair same thing as your weight so why about your weight love yourself first of all you need to love yourself you understand Lord. anyways first of all you need to love yourself love the skin you're in love your body love your little booty love your little titties love yourself that's step number one of putting on weight i mean y'all probably be like girl that ain't how you put on weight but yes that's how you put on weight now you see me trying to make a video like yeah that's step number one love yourself start worrying about your weight and trust me you will see drastic change in your body even in your but okay.
step two how i feel about um the syrups like apitamin or whatever y'all call it or like just any syrup that would make you eat to be honest most of those syrups they make you really oh my gosh like you be so hungry okay this was when i was skinny i tried the syrup and let me tell y'all something the hunger is excruciating okay like i don't like it to be honest i don't i rather just stay skinny i ain't gonna ask like off oh, before i eat this but i mean no, what the hell are you even saying look we're wrong with my roll my Oh, all my words. Okay. Yeah, I was like, before I even try the, um, the, before I made this into a routine, I'd rather just stay skinny or stay the size I was. I know I wasn't only skinny, I was bony. Like, I'm gonna put the picture on the screen. But yeah, y'all, I wasn't only skinny, I was really, 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 really small compared to, compared to now. But yeah, when it comes to like the syrups and stuff like that, I don't totally agree with them because y'all, when you hungry, it, it is don't play. And you like hungry like every second, every second. All you do is eat, sleep, eat, sleep, eat, sleep, eat, sleep, eat, sleep, eat, sleep. You can't do nothing else. You always tired. You always hungry. And then it makes your stomach, it gives you a stomach. Like it's not healthy weight. You understand like it gives you a big stomach i mean i understand that you can go to the gym and you could work out your stomach but yeah it gives you a big stomach so i don't totally agree with a syrup so if you if you want to try a syrup that's good i mean that's on you but i don't really like it for myself or i don't really recommend it to other people unless like they want they really want to put on weight and they don't really care about how hungry they may be or the stomach that it gives you I just be like, okay, you could try a syrup or whatever. But yeah, I don't really, I'm not really into that syrup thing. Just saying. Another way you can put on weight is Ensure. That's what put weight on me as well. I was drinking Ensure. When I was drinking Ensure, I saw a change. Like, I was putting on weight, but I was putting on weight slowly. Like, Ensure. When I started drinking and sure I saw like my thighs got I'm not saying that you're gonna grow a, a fat ass because not everybody is my type of fat ass and having a fat ass is not everything but in sure in sure is that why okay if you trying to get if you're trying to put on weight drink and sure I forgot to tell people that like people always ask me how I put on weight and sure really helps with putting on weight and that's real talk no intro does not make you taller i don't know where people get that from people think that when you drink intro i used to think that i'm gonna lie every time i drink intro i used to be like oh i'm gonna get too tall or whatever but it's not true intro does not make you tall it just put weight on you so intro is one good way to put on weight and i recommend intro because it tastes good period yeah and it don't make you hungry all the time like it don't make you hungry 24 7 so you could be at work and drink and sure. You could be doing homework, drink and sure. You could be in a tub, drink and sure. You could be on the toilet, drink and sure. You could drink and sure. Anywhere you go, you could drink and sure over there, drink and sure over there, or drink for here. But if you drink a syrup, you gotta make sure you're home. You gotta make sure you're somewhere where you always gotta eat or you always got food. So, yeah. Another way you can put on weight is, well, that was one way I put on weight, but I'm, I'm saying what I've heard. I heard people like they um, took Vitamalt and they drink it with milk or cream. Like y'all know the cardinal carnation. Yeah. Y'all I edited in this video. I can't believe I just say cardinal cream. Like I ain't just say that. Anyways, back, back to the video. Back. Carnation cream. They mix that with um, Vitamalt. I heard, I heard that I had at work. So like really, really 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 good people ask people use i hate to hear people say squats don't work i hate to hear people say squats don't work because squats work like i've seen it with my own eyes squats work working out works if you could be a skinny girl right your booty ain't even that big trust me try doing squats very often it will work i'm telling you 
do squats. Don't listen to nobody. Oh, squats don't work. That's because they're inconsistent. They probably don't even squat. They probably don't even know how to squat. They probably don't even squat with sets. Squat, y'all. Do y'all squats. It works. Period. You can't expect results in like one week. Squat for like, do a little 30 day, a 30 day workout and you will see a difference. Like, real talk, squats work. It does. But yeah, do I have anything else to say? Oh yeah, also, I do. what do I do to keep my stomach still intact? I drink sour soft leaf, like I drink a lot. My mom, she always making tea. And yeah, sour soft leaf is good. You drink it like it's tea or whatever. You drink it early, you can drink it early in the morning before you eat and you will go straight to the bathroom. <laughs> but yeah, y'all, sour soft leaf is a good, good, uh, substance to use when it comes to your stomach and stuff put down your stomach because it make you shed a lot <laughs> but yeah I think that's all I have to say that's how I put on weight like I stopped wanting about my weight started drinking Enjoy. started loving myself more and yeah that's that's the three things I do that's the three main things that I did and I got like I put on weight like I got thick like compared to how I was thick <laughs> okay anyways y'all that's it for today's video don't forget to like comment and subscribe thank you guys so 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 much also comment down below what you want to see or message me on facebook dm me what you guys want to see next and i know i haven't posted in one month it's because i'm working my ass off but I'm trying to get that check but yeah guys bye Hey, 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 hey,